the last thing here which is example 9 uh, from the book and this is a very interesting example since you can uh, it's very useful for you for your project if you understand it very well you will uh, benefit a lot from it maybe you can uh, with sim simple modification you can have a useful application so at the beginning here to understand it here we have kids books page and we have tick books page and these two classes extend the catalog uh, page if you go to the catalog page you will find that it's a servlet a servlet that uh, process uh, transactions or process the uh, the uh, the uh, the transaction also communicate with the order page so this will build build the interface it display the items for you it provides also the uh, buttons for it and after the after the user uh, the user click on a particular uh, item it will redirect the user into the order page you go to the order page also it's a servlet and look here in the uh, in the order page it creates a session and also notice the importance of synchronized session this will synchronize all instance of a session of the same type because the user may access the same site from different machines so but it's for the same user that's why you need to synchronize to avoid duplication so if you started like a, a, a transaction in a particular website and the, there is something in the cart and you get into that the same website again from different machine it will still remember you using your uh, user ID and that's why you need to synchronize the session to avoid duplication or uh, a loss of data uh, so this will handle the uh, processing the transaction and it will hand over after it process calculates the estimation that it gets from the uh, catalog page and it will then uh, send you into the checkout page which is an HTML it's not yet uh, implemented so you need to implement this uh, checkout maybe it will you need to modify this into not an HTML GSP maybe to provide users with a way to enter insert uh, financial information is bank account also you have to uh, if you go into the these four classes are in, in the fmohsen.external classes these are the data type that the uh, servlet uses to uh, store the information for example if there are books the book ID and book uh, details and uh, notice each one uh, is extending for example the shopping cart it's an array list of items and also the item order uses the a catalog item and if you go to the catalog item you will see that it consists of set of fields so here you need to modify the, the fields to fit with your flight uh, reservation system so to, to build it to start you have to start from understanding how what is the uh, basic uh, component of each item they assume that each item consists of a particular uh, uh, information set of information so let me just run it for run it on server just clean over here for example this page which is the tech box page just less two items so add the shopping cart and this is going to the order page and look at the ID number it passed the ID number and also you have you can here change the quant a quantity and update it will update the cost proceed to check out and this is the check out that page that we said it's not yet implemented but it's very helpful understand it well Modify it to fit your reservation system. Thank you.